using your soap dispenser in your pressure washer on this edition of the smoking beard all right so for this craftsman 2800 uh psi gas powered pressure washer it does come with a feature for your detergent and uh, i've had a couple of questions from some of the some of my viewers saying hey how do you use that i, I don't see anything uh, if you go through the manual it doesn't really tell you too much so i just wanted to clarify a couple of things here uh, to begin with the soap dispenser you can use pretty much any detergent if you're going to be using it for uh, like a degreaser type or to clean your your uh, cement or whatever it is you to wash your cars um, what you got to know that's very important about this is um whatever soap you're going to use i use for my for my car washing um, i use chemical guys this is a real good thing and um, a lot of the products that you're going to see here uh, i'll have a link on the description below just so you guys can Go ahead and go pick some up if you guys are interested but um the thing is whenever you're going to use a soap dispenser you need to put in only what you're going to use because um what's going to happen is that you're going to put in your soap into your soap dispenser and you're going to turn on your your uh pressure washer you're going to use the nozzle that's meant for soap to distribute the soap but your pressure washer cannot distinguish between when you want it to stop giving you soap and when you want it to not stop giving you soap so what it's going to do is it's going to apply soap until it finishes whatever you put on your little reservoir right there so do not go crazy and fill it all the way to the top because then you're going to have to basically drain all of your soap that's in here before you can use it as a regular pressure washer so that's a, a very very something that you need to keep in mind um i, I would just put in a couple uh, a little bit at a time until you know that you're done because if not you are going to be wasting a lot of soap um so that was a main main factor there um do not put more soap than you're gonna need to uh whenever you're gonna use it because if not you're gonna be wasting water trying to get rid of the soap that's in there because you're trying to get rid of that all right um if if you are looking to use something that has a little bit more control over your pressure washer and the soap i would recommend you guys get something that looks like this and again I have a link on the description below for stuff like this. This is a this is like a foam cannon, foam guys. There's all these different names to it, but um, I use this with this instead of using this, uh, only because I have a lot more control over it. Here you can uh, put it on, at the tip of your uh, pressure washer. You can go ahead and uh, spray it down with all the soap you want, and when you're done, you just take this off and you put a regular tip on it. So that's like one of the main main. Um, advantages of using this type of uh soap dispensing over this one the other major one is um, when you throw soap through this soap dispenser it's just gonna throw soap it's not gonna be this elaborate amount of soap coming out this extra foam what this does and especially if you use something like this this type of product um it will throw you like a snow style type of foam that'll cling to your car it'll cling to whatever you're throwing in there so that you guys can go ahead and uh, allow it to penetrate and then wash it off. So that's a major, major um, advantage of using this type of attachment as opposed to this. I hope this answers your question. Um, please uh, feel free to leave comments on the bottom and uh, let me know what you guys think. Again, all these products that I have here, I, I will go ahead and put a, a link on the description below uh, so you guys can quickly link to it through uh, Amazon and uh, text, test it out for yourselves and then let me know what you guys think all right this has been the smoking beer thank you for watching and i'll catch you guys on the flip side